Yes, it's your favorite show, Star Girl. But well, as we promised, we're gonna come back with the same old clothes. We're here to entertain you. Well, this episode is not about entertainment. This episode is more about yes, getting nostalgic and of course getting more powerful with your own thoughts. And that is why we are right here again with none other than Nasiji. Nasiji, Namaskar, Namaste, and welcome again to Star Girl. Namaste everyone and thank you again for having me on Star Darbar. Let's move along. I want to ask you now that, you know, like acting or uh, working in movies and working in television, what are the differences? Like, is there any difference or no? Yes, this is the same yes, thing. Yes, yes. See, I've done a lot of theater also. I've done a lot of plays. Um, yeah. I've done a lot of television, I've done movies, I'm doing web series now. So I look at it as modes of transport. My breakdown of these things are as a mode of transport. When I'm doing a film, I'm traveling in business class. When I'm relaxed, I'm sitting down, everything is very slow. I get to choose my channels, I get to take my seat in the back, you know, I'm, when I'm doing television, it's a bit more fast. I'm, I'm, I'm in the train. There are a lot of people, they're pushing, I have to, yeah, station, servo station, yeah, because episodes have to keep coming out. Mm. You know, there's no time to think, there's no time to pause, because if I don't step out, I'll miss the station, or if I don't get it now, I'll miss the train. You know, this train to that train, local, fast train, so that's how it is doing television. You have to be on your feet. You are up all the time. And as far as uh, theater is concerned, it's like sitting in an auto. You have zero facility. You have nothing. You know, cars going in the side are splashing water on you. You know, you're not getting to go. So that's how theater life is. Because the money is not there. You know, the luxury is not there. But yes, you, you get to enjoy. You feel all the road bumps. You feel everything. You know, you get that exercise, that mental exercise, the facial exercise, the body exercise of what being in a character is, what performance is in theatre. In television, it's nothing. I'm getting 100 rupees per day. I'm working 20 days. I'm making 2000 rupees per month, period. It's only simple math in television. In films, it's a recognition. It's a fame. If I do this, people will recognize me. I'll become famous. People are going to come for autographs and photographs. I'll become a known personality. I go somewhere along the line, you become a part of history. You become a part of the Indian cinema legacy. Mm. So for me, they are all three different modes of transport. But at the same time, none is different than the other. They all are equal. They all are getting into your destination. The problem is, the problem is when you're doing theater and you think you're going to go in a business class. No, you go in an auto only. Or if you're doing a film and you think that I want to be in the train, it's not my lucky way. They're taking four hours for lighting. I am ready. I want to ready perform. No. Relax. When the short is ready, they will call you. So you. You need to alter your mindset. So I learned that very early on. Uh, so when I'm doing either of these, I know when I'm doing TV, what I have to do. When I'm doing theater, what I have to do. When I'm doing uh, a film or a web series, what I have to do. And therefore I enjoy that auto ride, that train ride, that plane ride, because I'm going to new destinations. I'm meeting new people. I'm meeting different class of people. You know, I'm learning from them, which I'm adapting in my characters and portraying on the screen, which people get to see. So you have to be observant. You have to grab from here and there. And how he's talking, and how that one is walking, how he's doing, what she's doing. See how they're laughing. So you have to pick on these things. So all strata of life, because in some film or some character, you'll be a poor person or you'll be a rich person. How are you going to know? How does a rich man behave? You are not rich. You are living in a rented apartment 
trying to make money to pay your rent. And here you're given a suit and boot and a pipe and you're acting like a rich man. How does a rich man act? I'm not rich. I don't know, boy. I have come by bus. You know, if you tell a rich man to act poor, they don't know how to act poor. And that's what's happening to cinema today. When you take a rich kid and you tell him that you're poor, ma, roti bana rahi hai. You have no money. He does not know. He wants to wear his boots and jeans. अरे भाई दिलीप कुमार ने वो और बूट एंड जींस ये वो धोती ये वो फटा हुआ कुर्ता बिकॉज ही न्यू वॉट अ पोअर मैन अरे ये आयन नहीं किया नो नो देर इज नो आयन वुड बी कंप्लीट यू नो सो इट इज दीज लिटिल न्यूसेस विच टूडे इज मिसिंग इन दंग जनरेशन बिकॉज एवरीथिंग इज बिकम सो फेब्रिकेटेड इवन द बर्थडे मैसेज गोज एज अ व्हाट्सएप आई मीन अर्लियर यू हैव टू गो एंड विश पीपल एंड हक देम To know कि हैप्पी बर्थडे भाई अभी तो क्या आपने सुबह उठ के हैप्पी बर्थडे टू यू पोस्ट कर दिया सोशल मीडिया पे भेज दिया व्हाट्सएप पे वेर इज द कनेक्टिविटी एवरीथिंग इज फेब्रिकेटेड सो देर इज नो टच विद रियालिटी सो इफ देर इज नो टच विद रियालिटी आई ऑटोमेटिकली स्टार्ट बिकमिंग इमोशनलिस बट आई एम इन द प्रोफेशन वेर आई हैव टू पोर्ट्रे एन इमोशन इफ आई एम इमोशनलिस हाउ कैन आई पोर्ट्रे एन इमोशन Yeah, so true, so true, so true. I mean, um, well, um, you are an experienced actor because uh, I think that, as you say, that theater or play uh, that actually make uh, a true actor. I'm not saying uh, like something wrong who are self taught. No, uh, nothing is wrong if someone is self taught. Not everybody. in one household can hold that opportunity to go out and explore different things so there are a lot of people out there who are self taught who love to learn every day who went through or who go through craziness like to learn the lines or how to say things but um i would i would like to ask you that what like <laughs> if i ask you that your favorite moment in your work life that you really love to cherish to be very honest with agani none because i don't bring that home i leave it on the set only it's done it's done i have done it is gone to be editing it will come out to the people and let it be their cherishing moment no Why am I so conceited and why am I so full of myself that put oh, that scene I did? No, it's not. It's not for me to remember. I will remember the scene of Amitabh Bachchan. Yeah, I would love to remember the scene of Dharamji. I want to remember their scenes. I don't remember my scene. And the way I have, I have, I have put my career graph is the initial years of my life. I learned from my seniors. I was mm-hmm. when I was young. I learned from my seniors. You know, so it took me. A good eight, nine, ten years to find my own self without learning from anybody, and I did that. And COVID came in, and during COVID and after COVID, I have emptied my mind. I have unlearned everything. I have unlearned everything. Now I learn from the youngsters, people who are eighteen. people who are tiktok stars people who are very famous on instagram social media influencers i learn i watch their videos i study them i learn them ki why does she have 45 million followers there's something in her that i don't i cannot see you know so what is it let me try and see that and if i can find it maybe i can adapt that in myself so if i have at the start of my career i held the hands of my seniors and i came to a point and then i did my own walk now if i need to go for the next more 25 years i can't go back to those seniors mm-hmm. because that has become obsolete it's a blackberry phone khatam ho gaya it was very good 20 years ago or a blackberry phone aaya you can email and you can do things and you know it's a messenger you can chat with people but where is blackberry to it's gone it's over now there are new 
things and now there is a new technology called ai and there is a new new social media now threads have come out twitter has become into x where are we headed so if i want to go with them i can't hang on to those people i need to latch on to these youngsters these 18 year olds and these 20 year olds that i'm working with ke hey bro teach me man how how to you teach me i need to learn from you what is how to do this what is how is done teach me so i'm learning from them now my entire process has is gone into reverse gear mm-hmm. because if i need to survive for the next more 25 years mm-hmm. i need to pick up from these 20 year olds who are going to be there for the next 20 years so wo log they will hold my hand and take me ahead so Stop. coming back to your question as far as my career thing no i don't i the once i have finished my scene it's over i don't remember anything i don't want to remember anything like people come and tell me yeah in that film or in that scene you like that one scene of yours that is a thing for me to relish and say you know thank you yaar thank you that is what i want not came who made it a thing i don't i because i don't take anything home. Except the uh, checks. <laughs> all right, okay, all right, we we take that. But uh, but tell us something that when you go for auditioning, I mean, this is something that I felt to ask you because uh, you have been done uh, like you know so many um, uh, advertisements as well, and. couple of them are quite pretty famous because those time it was not much because i still remember that it was not much of the drinks that we used to have in our childhood so one of them was rasna and it's like to making it to to see you and you know so just so just tell me that um that like acting is one part of course but like uh, going for this type of uh, advertisement shoots or auditioning um how uh, how 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 is that like what what you have to really do or how many days you have to wait or in the line i mean how how the process uh, goes for i i am recto i have no problem if कास्टिंग डायरेक्टर आस्क्स मी एंड टेल्स मी कि आपने पहले क्या किया सो आई आई प्रॉम्प्टली रिप्लाई नथिंग नो बिकॉज इफ यू थॉट सी नाउ यू डोंट टॉक अबाउट मी यू टॉक अबाउट हिम ही डज नॉट नो आई हैव डन सो दैट इज वाई इट आस्किंग मी ना कि वॉट हैव यू डन You understand where I'm coming from. The casting director, he's a 22 year old boy. He does not know anything. He, आपने पहले क्या किया? I said nothing. अच्छा okay. Then you send. Can you send me the audition? I'll send it. I don't want to sit with him and tell him, oh, you don't know who I am. You ask. No, why? He does not know. So there's nothing wrong. Why should I blame him? Maybe I should have done better. Maybe I should have done more for him to just recognize me. He is not going to ask that to an Amitabh Bachchan or Salman Khan or to any other actor. Shahrukh Khan, what did you do first? You understand? So maybe I still haven't achieved it. Not maybe I definitely have not achieved it. So that process is still always there. So I don't feel upset or angered when I hear my my contemporary say that. हमसे सीवी पूछते हमसे पूछते कि आपने पहले क्या किया ऐसे तो पूछते तो गलत क्या है भाई वट इज रॉन्ग इन आस्किंग समी आई थिंक वट हैव यू डन समथिंग रॉन्ग दे डोंट नो दैट मीन्स यू हैव डन दैट मच दैट फॉर देम टू नो देन बडी डू मो ना गेट अपन एस एंड गो एड एंड डू मो अचीव मो सो फॉर मी इट इज लाइक दैट फॉर मी एन ऑडिशन देर आर लॉट ऑफ ऑडिशन आई डू एंड i get my nice i do my audition and uh, i do have a great job and i sit back and i see it and i say nahi 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 this is wrong acting now you are again doing that 90s wali acting 
you know you are giving those same pauses and those no acting has changed cinema has changed digital has come there is a different kind of performances people are looking at there are new actors in the horizon who are who are giving out different kinds of performances i still can't keep imitating rajesh khanna and dilip kumar in my mind because they don't know who they are my children don't know who they are so it doesn't mean just because my children ask watching a song of my dad if there is dilip uncle over there and saying who is this man they don't know who dilip kumar is so that does not mean that dilip kumar has not achieved anything it is their ignorance that they don't know they need to open their minds and their horizon you know so for me today when i there are some auditions i do and say nahi galat ho gaya bhai ye to purani acting ho gayi change karo isko change karo isko what is happening today and then that's why i like to sit and learn from these youngsters because they're doing something and they're being appreciated by the by the generation of today there was a generation in the 90s that used to love me right there was a generation in the 90s that used to love me my my ads and my tv shows and my anchoring and my hosting and my music videos they used to love me so i've got that love and appreciation but now with me they have gone become older yeah but they have got children their children want to see something else but at the same time i know for a fact that me and actors like me and that entire set of actors of that time have that talent in them to perform like these people and perform better than them the problem is hum kyu kare hum kyu audition kare humse audition mangte nahi karna audition to aapko kaam nahi milta aapko kaam nahi milta to log aapko dekhte nahi hai log aapko dekhte nahi hai so they don't know you so true so for this younger people to know you you need to be out there i mean a lot of people tell me every time that i go out today the best compliment i hear young boys and girls are are we love your reels sir we love your reels your reels are a lot of fun why you don't act in movies <laughs> oh my god <laughs> oh my goodness so i take it as a compliment that i am trying beta pray for me that i get a big movie if you pray for me i'll get it oh of course i will love you i would love to see you on big screen so the younger generation is telling me why because from my instagram reels Why you don't do movies? Yeah, you should go back. Yeah, you are so good. Yeah, why they don't take you? I said, you ask them. Why don't they don't take me? I don't want to work. So if they want to see me, someone somewhere out there will hear it. No? Someone somewhere out there will hear it. So I need to, I need to bring myself, bring myself to the forefront, to the generation of today. Okay, bro, I am also there. I am also there. i am and i know my experience i know i have my experience i may not have age i may not i may not have another 50 years but what this young generation is going to achieve in 50 years i can achieve it in one year because that experience i have they have time they don't have experience hmm absolutely i have experience and with today's technologies i am telling you ragini if this whole thing that we're doing right now If it was there when I was twenty-four, it would have been a different scenario. Social media, the mobile phones. Yeah, I mean, you're sitting in America. I'm sitting in India. We're talking like this live. Yeah. What more do you want? There's so much more you can achieve. People are editing on the mobile phones. There are apps. There are filters. There are software. So many things. Where we had and we had nothing. Take one photo and wait for seven days for the bloody reel to develop, and then you get to see the photo is good or bad. <laughs> Absolutely true. Yeah, <laughs> I speak to I speak to few 
uh, people who are in the industry and who worked for more than 20, 25 years. So they tell me stories that how they used to edit, like cut those reels and patch it up and then come. I'm like, oh my God. And they, like, he tells me so many stories about how it evolved into a totally different thing. What we feel that it's so common, like, you know, like taking an iPhone and do stuff like within a blink, it's not <laughs> like nothing is impossible. Like sometimes as you are saying that Instagram reels, some of them, I feel like, wow, look at that, how creative that is, how beautiful that is. And some of them are really training others with that how you can take your own video, what you have to do. How I you watch all those videos. I watch all those videos. I learn. Yeah. And then I edit them. I make them. Oh, look at that. I make them. <laughs> mm. You know? Yeah. But what would take a newcomer Probably two hours or three hours, it takes me two minutes. Mm -hmm. Because I, I know the technique behind it. Yeah. 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 You know, I know the output, I know the outcome. So for me, it is like that. I am, I am learning. I'm, for me, it's a whole learning process. This, this entire thing. And that is why I am, I am moving forward. I am not a frustrated old actor. You know, I'm not our time tha. You know what work? No, nothing. Time is over, bro. Time is finished. There are new times, there are different times, times are ahead. People are talking about going on different planets. You're still really talking about nineteen eighty five and nineteen ninety-five. Where are you, man? I don't want so, to be here the next ten years. I want to be on some different planet doing acting over there. I I'm, I'm done enough of acting over there. I'll go with Elon Musk over there and I'll do something over there. I don't oh my God. We, you know, we need uh, the mentor, the motivator like you in the industry. I do believe so. Because when the the moon. No, when, when the newcomers, <laughs> they come, I, I hope they find mentor like you or someone, whoever is listening to this episode. I will really request to you guys that please, 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 watch this episode like several times get the positive vibe uh, from uh, Nasir Ji and the major 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 part is the way he really motivated me today to think things in a very different way which maybe I was losing seriously I was not feeling good for a couple of days and now after I really speak to you I am really talking from my heart that you just made me realize that Ragini, it is not the end. There is thousands of things you can do and you can go and you can fly up high. And exactly this is the thing that I would like to tell all the young achievers out there or maybe who are already in the industry. But yes, still you are thinking that you are not good. No, but I think after this conversation, you will feel the same like me that no, I am the best in my way. And that is what exactly I think that I will hold this thought today and I will take it with me. And I am I'm going to rock. I'm serious about that. And Nasaji, it yes, was you. our pleasure. It was our pleasure to meet you, to talk to you, to give us time so quick. There was, I, I will say these words because some people make it so difficult to get in touch with them. I don't know. Those uh, celebrity issues are there, I do believe. But, well, again, we're all human beings. Um, our uh, patients are also get lost some time. And also we feel that, oh, God, what am I doing wrong here? But to meeting you, to give us time so quickly, we are honored to have you with us. And anything new you are doing, Manative International, Christian Entertainment, and Blue Eye Creation would love to be in touch with you and talk about it more, uh, what is your upcoming, whatever whatever you are doing. Please take us as your friend, but yes, we cannot go to your house and eat right now. But Why not? Maybe one day we'll come. Yeah. We'll go 
go and eat and have this chat again. We are going to revive again in our heart that how good was We won't have cha chat. We also have chat. Oh, my God. <laughs> Thank you so much. Absolutely. Absolutely. Chat GPT. <laughs> sure. Sure. So, uh, before you go, um, I would love to uh, ask you to say um, some, I mean, like this whole episode is a motivational episode, but still you have some thoughts in your mind which you think that uh, those young achievers can uh, take it and uh, conquer the world, if you can say a few things. Like, um, like my dad used to always say, okay, uh, I'll say it in Hindi and then I'll translate it in English. Okay, he used to always say, okay, apni zarurat aur apni khwahish mein fark pata hona chahiye. You should know the difference between your needs and your desires. Because a lot of people to in the urge to fulfill their desires are not even able to fulfill their needs. We used to always say that. So first, fulfill your needs. What are your basic requirements? Fulfill that. What everybody has desires. Everybody has desires. And people who are right at the top, who've achieved and gone beyond their desires, automatically come down to their basic needs. They want to spend time with their family. They want to take a walk in the park. They want to take the time off. They want to play with children. They go back to those needs, moments of happiness. Mm -hmm. So focus on your needs first automatically your desires will be fulfilled. Don't focus on the desires. Keep them there. They will, you will achieve them. But in pursuit of that, don't let your needs be gone. Oh and the world is there. Go and achieve it. Mm. So true. So true. And with this note, I think that we are going to finish this episode. I know that I have thousands of things to say, thousands of things to ask, because um, right now you're you have my number. Me. Ask me. <laughs> you, you have my number. Call me. Ask me anytime. I will. I will. Because as you say that social influencers, I think that and you... Follow me on Instagram. Uh -huh. Follow me on Instagram. <laughs> They will do that. Trust me, they will do that. Oh, absolutely. Na na so, at the rate, Nasser Khan official. <laughs> uh, sure, absolutely. We we will do that uh, together. Yes. Thank you so much for being here, Nasirji. And our pleasure to have you here. And um, and always stay blessed. Keep the smile on your face all the time. So, um, a common person like me or the young achievers or whoever is trying to get something, they can have their mental boost from you. And thanks again. Thanks again to come Thank here you. once again. Thank you. Thank you.